Hi there and uh, welcome back to the Floss Marketing School. In this video, we are going to see how you can modify a PDF, a multi-page PDF document with uh, with GIMP. So the typical use case is the following one. So you have a contract and you need, for example, to sign out uh, at the uh, bottom right and corner all the pages indicating uh, who you are. Uh, and you need to do it on multiple pages. So for this, I created a fake uh, contract that you can see over here and I use for that already you assume uh, generator. So now I have my PDF document and I would like to add the initials. So the initials, I set them up on um, in Inkscape. Actually, I use a, a, a Wacom tablet in order to draw with a pen uh, my initial in order to make it uh, more realistic. Uh, not that actually you could make, of course, uh, the line a little bit a uh, little bit bigger. But now we have somehow the feeling that I and write uh, my, my initial, which is a which is a good thing. Then uh, you take your three page contract. Um, so I have here my uh, my initials, uh, and the idea is how can I insert those uh, within the, the three pages document. So uh, you just open them up with with GIMP, so you will get your uh, your three layers. So let's go back on GIMP. So here I got my my three layers. So I want to uh, import them all. So I import. I import them all and uh, so I don't want this part, I'm just gonna discard it. Okay, so here is my contract. I want to insert at the bottom of all the pages uh, the initial. So I open as a layer my uh, initials, which are um, documents and I name them RC. So recently use RC. Okay, up. Okay, here you can see uh, that the initials no it is transparent um yeah the initials are not transparent which is not uh, really good for me so i may probably be able to remove them like this we will see uh, how it looks like um and yeah it's not it's not that perfect uh anyway i'm just gonna select select it and uh, Oops. Select. Okay, so as you can see, I dislike either the color and either the size. So I'm just going to adjust this. I'm going to reduce it and put it at 150. Uh, maybe 120. Okay. Okay. Looks better. But as you can see, I barely can see uh, the initial. So I'm gonna just uh, change the color. Um, I think I can use the. Okay. If I put it like this. Like this. Okay. I can see now a little bit more the, the initial, even if it's far from being perfect. Uh, let's see what I can do. Um, colors, color balance. Yeah, not better. Anyway, I'm going to keep it. Uh, I'm going to keep it like this. Okay. Um, so I'm going to uh, just uh, Keep this. I'm gonna just duplicate it for each each of the page of the contract. Okay. Okay. So so far so good. So if I look at this given page, I will get it. If I look at this page, I will get it as well. So uh, I'm fully happy uh, now. So let's um, let's now merge it down. So I merge it down. I merge it down, and I merge it down. Okay, so next step is about uh, reversing the layer because the method that we're going to use require that uh, we reverse the layer. So three goes at the top and seconds go in in second. Okay, um, and now what uh, one can do is that uh, we just go on the file, we just export as and the three page contract is not going to be a PDF, it's going to be an MNG. MNG, uh, I'm going to select uh, the MNG, uh, MNG animation and just to ensure that everything goes as planned, I'm just going to select MNG, 
ng ng okay document three page contract export um i'm gonna keep it this way okay so now it's an mg file and next step is about uh, converting it so now i need to access to uh, the terminal i'm gonna access to my document so document represents the location where i have my documents yep sorry for that Maybe it's capital d okay. um and it's about so convert convert what convert my three pages contract emg into a, a results.pdf okay so if uh, during the process you are facing this given error okay the one that you can see here saying that you are not authorized uh, just look for the internet and inform uh, solution about it here they told me that the issue can be fixed by just uh, writing the following line of code uh, such as i did over here so i execute this line and then i perform the uh, command that i was showing you and as a result now it it works so I get, in fact, my PDF. Uh, we cannot see it on this one. Uh, Results.pdf. Uh, but we can clearly see it on this one. You see, I get the initials, which are now part of the PDF uh, document. And we have a feeling that it's part of the document. And that's it for today. So hope you enjoyed this video. Thanks for watching.